Well, well, Fritz. I felt I told you I don't have time to waste with you. That being said, and although they were low-class demons, I'm surprised you were able to get through so many of them. As foolish as you are, I'll chuck that up to the fact that you are King Krzyczewskoy's son. How could you destroy my... the Overlord statues like that? How could you? <laughs> That's what I'd like to ask you. Using your father's notoriety to claim the title of Overlord and performing tyrannical acts for your own benefit. You are nothing short of evil to us. You are as foolish as King Krzyczewskoy was wise. You have zero qualities of an Overlord. I cannot allow your tyranny to continue. Is that why you destroyed the statues? Precisely. However, this is only the beginning. We will force you to forfeit the throne and leave the Overlord's castle. Fool! No one can order me to do anything! I, the Overlord, make my own decisions about everything! But how many demons in the Netherworld would agree with what you just said? You could probably count them all on one hand. Oh, shut up! At the very least, you'll have to convince me if you want to call yourself the Overlord. You are just my old man's vassal! Don't act so cocky! If you aren't convinced, then let me demonstrate the absolute power I wield as the Overlord! Oh well, I suppose I have no choice. It is the responsibility of an adult to punish bad children. I shall discipline you! Look at my muscles!
gold! Single point piercing! Zip! Spell you later! My uber trained body! Take this! Ready, go! Good look at my muscles! My uber trained body. Pretty, dude. Here I go. Magic. where we just roll our eyes and listen to his pitiful excuses. Huh! So, do you accept me as the overlord now? You don't get it. 
do you? It doesn't matter if you possess ultimate power. You still don't have what it takes to be the Overlord. Fool! All an Overlord needs is to be powerful. Therefore, I, the strongest demon in the Netherworld, have everything it takes to be a great Overlord. Like I said before, I can't accept you as King Krzyzewsko's successor. Enjoy playing Overlord. For now. they find it, let's wreak some havoc. Understood. Lahara, what kind of person was Krzyzewski? That was way out of left field. Since that demon said you're nothing like King Krzyzewski, I've been wondering what made him such a great person. I don't know. I never tried to know. Let's go back to the Overlord's castle. All right. What's all the commotion? We've got big trouble. Please, take a look at this. Huh? What, what is this? I don't know, but we need to do something about it before something bad happens. Hmm. We are in dire need of a worthy overlord as soon as possible. Call in all of our officers. There's no time to waste. Yes, sir. Hmm. What are they up to? Damn angels. To end the tyranny of evil overlord Laharl, the super cute demon gal Edna has descended upon this netherworld! Hey! Using her vassal, fallen angel Flan, as a shield, Edna dashes through wave after wave of demon attacks! That's. that's just cruel! Stop right there, evil overlord Laharl! All your fame and riches belong to me now! What a selfish bitch! Next time on Demon Gal Etna Dimension 2, Episode 2, The Birth of Overlord Etna. A new history begins now! Stop with all the lies! Did you find out where Grosso went? Not yet, but the printy should be back right about now. Lahara, there's a package for you from Celestia. From Celestia? Isn't it just something for you? It's probably just another morphing belt or more ranger figures. I really can't stand to look at that junk, so can you stop collecting them at the Overlord's castle? No! I live for those things! But anyway, this isn't for me. Every printy said it was for the Overlord. I see! For the Overlord, huh? Then it must be for me! <laughs> He's so simple. Anyway, isn't it strange that Laharo is getting something from Celestia? I've got a bad feeling about this. Um, 
No, if anything, that was pure stupidity. A puny little idiot angel like you doesn't have what it takes to be the Overlord. Um, you're really bossy. What gives you the right to say that? Oh yeah, he's Laharl. Contrary to how he looks, he's actually the Overlord. There is nothing contrary about it, Flan. I look like the Overlord from any angle. What? Really? I was picturing someone much bigger. That's what most people would think. In that case, let me begin with... Big Brother Overlord, can I take your spot as Overlord? You're even stupider than I thought! No demon would give up being the Overlord! Really? In that case, let me give you this. What is it? Pretty cookies that I baked. I use plenty of sugar so they're really tasty. Being the Overlord or cookies? Hmm, that's a tough decision, isn't it? Enough of this mockery! What are you doing? That's it, Angel. I'll make you regret ever wanting to be the Overlord. Laharo, stop! She's just a little girl. Let go, Flan! I don't care if she's small. She could be old for all I care. I can't let her get away with that. I heard that demons were violent, but I didn't think they were this bad. Bye for now. I have to come up with a new plan. Damn it! Hey, Edna! Follow that angel! Why? We could just leave her be. Some monster would probably eat her. No! An overlord can't let anyone get away with trying to take their position! Okay, fine. I'm going.
Lily is surrounded by demons. This doesn't look good for her. That's true, but something doesn't seem right. Hmm, who cares? I'm going to catch her. Proclaimed Overlord, I am the absolute one and only Overlord! But all these demons say they don't know who you are! Really? All those statues were for nothing? Damn you! Fine! Then I will engrave into your rotten brains! That I am the ultimate overlord of the netherworld! My muscles! I'll destroy all of you! <laughs> Fly away! Put! 